who have come to make merit today to dedicate to those who passed away. So we want to make sure that your merit is complete. Generosity, virtue, meditation. You've given a gift already. We're all observing the precepts in line with our status. What's left is to meditate. That's the most important part of it, because merit is actually a quality of the mind. They say that you make merit or you do merit, make it sound like there's something outside, but it's actually in the mind. It's a quality of happiness that comes when you know that you've done something good, both for yourself and for other people. In other words, you're looking for happiness in a way that doesn't cause anybody any harm. And you're willing to share and happy to share your, the goodness that comes from that kind of happiness. So look inside your heart. Is your heart in good shape right now? Because the heart is, it's, it's through the heart that we dedicate merit. And you pour out the water. That's just a symbol of the coolness of the merit that you're making. But the real merit is inside. And the mind sends out its currents. You've probably noticed this. A person can walk into a room and immediately the atmosphere changes. Everybody has a current of the mind, stronger or weaker to some extent. And it's through the currents of the mind that we can still get in touch with people who passed away, dedicate merit to them. If they approve of what we've done, then it becomes their merit too. So you want to send them a good current so that they'll be happy to approve of it. So get your mind calm and cool right now. Settle with the breath. And the quality of the mind grows with the more that you have it focused. So get it focused on the breath, and don't be thinking about anything else. Just stay right here. And the value of the mind grows also as you make it focused. You can think of fruit in the market. If there's lots of fruit, it doesn't have much price, doesn't have much value. But if they say there's only one durian in the entire market, you can imagine how expensive that would be. It's the same with the mind. The more it's one, the higher its value. This is the kind of current that you want to be sending out, the kind of current you want to be dedicating. That even though the people we love have passed away, goodness is still here in the world. And you can prove it to yourself by creating goodness inside your own mind. That's a good way of showing doing honor to those who passed away as well. We show that when they've left us, we don't throw away the goodness that they taught us, that we maintain it as a gift from them. When you maintain this gift, okay, then you still have a piece of them inside you. Nurture it, look after it well. And that creates a connection. It's through that connection that the currents of the mind can flow even more strongly. So we are generous, we're virtuous, we train the mind in goodwill, we train the mind in concentration and discernment. All of this is meritorious. Or if you don't like the word merit for bunya, you can say, all of this is really good, in a really deep sense of goodness. Because you know deep inside, down inside, when you look for happiness in this way, it really does feel good. It's good for the people around you. So keep on making as much of this kind of happiness as you can, because it is something you can make. But happiness is not something that just comes floating by and we happen to get hit by it. It comes from our actions, and our actions come out of the mind. And so a, a good mind finds it easier and easier to create more goodness. So put your mind in good shape, so that it's, it's goodness is something that it keeps creating every day, every day. And you can dedicate merit every day for anybody who would be happy to receive it, you're willing to give. That actually increases your merit as well. Someone once asked, if I dedicate merit to others, do I have anything left? They asked that of John Fuang, and he gave that person a look. The math of merit is not the same as the math of material things. The math of merit is the more you give away, the more you get. And it's something you can make from within. And the more you make, the higher its value. So make merit, 
and then be happy to share it with others, because it's the kind of happiness that doesn't create boundaries, it doesn't cause any difficulties, you don't have to take anything away from anyone else. You create it from within and share it with others. Other people are happy to receive it. It's because of this that we can live with one another in the world. And we can make the world a good place through our actions. Good not while we're here and good for where we're going to go.